So what difference does that make for the patient? In the, uh, in, after an ablation, is, it, is there any difference to how the patient would feel or how the patient will respond to an ablation? Yeah, so the main, the main advantage to this is that it is delivered in a way that is very selective to the uh, tissue that we're targeting. Whereas thermal energy traditionally, uh, which was traditionally used, did not differentiate and, or doesn't differentiate between the targeted structure and the nearby structures. As such, there was some risk of collateral injury or damage. The risk is much less with uh, pulse feed ablation, and that's why pulse feed ablation is increasingly used, primarily because of the safety profile. Not only that, but it's also very efficient, and the procedures got much shorter, which means less time under full anesthesia for patients. Okay, so these are the main advantages. Some additional advantages in terms of workflow and recovery um, include uh, less uh, likelihood of inflammation around the heart, uh, us being able to send patients home same day, uh, sometime following day, but usually uh, because uh, of the safety profile, we feel more comfortable uh, sending patients home same day.